What's up in War Eagle War Report family? We are back with another great fantasy time. PrizePicks.com, your man Ike Jones and the War Report. We're getting into it. It's Auburn versus Missouri today. The Tigers take their number one ranking on the road for the first test since getting that ranking against Missouri. Let's see what the Tigers have in store. It's time to get into it. It's Prize Picks. It's the War Report. Let's go. All right, you already know, we got to go back and look at what has already happened. Unfortunately for your boy, not such a great card this last time. Listen, the only person that came through and did what they were supposed to do was Wendell Green Jr. getting multiple threes in that game. Uh, But uh, Walker Kessler left me one short on the rebounding. Kellen Grady hit two too many uh, three-pointers for me. And then Oscar Sheepway went over the total uh, for what he needed to do on points there. So we got to bounce back against Missouri. So let's see if we can get back into the win column. Get us a great card going on here this time around. So let's see what we got available on prizepicks.com for this game, Auburn versus Missouri. All right, as always, we are going to get jumped in here to prizepicks.com. We're looking at college basketball and we need to get to let's go to the opposing team first Missouri Kobe Brown is who we're looking at um, here or Jaron Coleman for Missouri let's take a look at what they have on their totals for the year I'm not super familiar with Missouri Uh, their leading scorer on the year is Brown he's averaging 13.8 points per game he is a fairly efficient shooter and a decent free throw shooter. He's getting a lot of his points from the free throw line when he does score big. Um, and he's he's kind of a uh, he's not a he's not a big three point shooting forward. So that means it's going to be interior defense. That means it's going to be Jabari likely um, guarding him initially to start this game out. Keeping him under 13 points in this game seems like a tall task, but you know what? I I just commented how I feel like Jabari has gotten committed to the defensive end, and I think that uh, Bruce Pearl and company are going to put some sort of plan together to get the ball out of his hands or get him into spots where he's not going to be as comfortable. I know Missouri's going to want to work the ball through him, but I am going to put him on my card here and see what we can do with him. Uh, Let's go over here to the Auburn side uh, and and see what we can have for our squad today. Jabari, 15.5. You know, he is averaging just below that. So he's averaging about 15 points per game right now. Uh, So is he going to get above his average today is going to be the question. Uh, let's see what else we have here. Two assists for Jabardi is a good one. KD Johnson, will he score over 13? I like a card with KD on it, uh, just because I feel like he is due for a big game. Let's, let's get KD Johnson out here on one. And then KD is such a hit or miss on these three pointers, right? Like he, he's, you know, I expect him to take more than, than, two threes is he going to make more than two is the question Jabari on rebounds right now Jabari is averaging uh, rebounds per game this year he's averaging six I think that's a decent number to be able to get him on so let's go with Jabari on rebounds so we've got a a, a pick three card here I'm going to take the under the over and the over so I'm going to say that Kobe Brown is going to be under 13 points per uh, in this game. KD Johnson will be over 13 points and Jabari Smith will c- capture at least six rebounds in this game. Uh, let's do this. Um, we'll use a card here and place this as an entry. Again, I'm going to hit my flex on this one. And what I'm actually going to do today for the first time is I'm going to put in an alternate card different stuff that I'm going to put in here. I am going to actually go with a card that includes Jabari on points. And I liked this number over here on Missouri with Kobe Brown, excuse me, um, Jerron Coleman 
I think I'm going to take his assist number here and we're going to do the over on both of those. So for the first time in uh, what we're doing here, we've got two separate cards that I'm doing here. Um, and I'm actually going to take a power play card on this one. So I'm going to see if we can possibly have two different opportunities to successfully be able to make something happen today. This is the first time I've done something like this and split this into two separate cards um, just so I can get two different statistics going on for a singular player. I split those up. And so we'll see how that one goes this time. Again, we're just trying different things here on uh, Prize Picks to do different fantasy options and hopefully it works out for us. So we'll see how it goes. All right, that's it. That's your fantasy picks for today. Uh, got two cards in today, so I'm going to be watching intently for this game. I expect the Tigers to handle business, that being the Auburn Tigers, handling business against Missouri today. But just to make it more interesting, we do have prizepicks.com to put some more intrigue and interest into what's going on uh, outside of just the raw score for the game. As always, you all can do the same thing. You can go to prizepicks.com and you can put in code rapport. That's R-A-P-P-O-R-T when you sign up to make sure you get locked into what we've got going on. That link if you want to go directly to that, it's going to be in the description of this video. Outside of that, you need to be doing the diligence, which is liking this video, subscribing to the channel, and in the comment section, let me know if you decided to put a card in for today. What is your fantasy pick for the day? Do you like the card that we went with? Do you have some different things that you want to go to? Um, we used to do this with betting with B-Will. Maybe we'll put some sort of collaborative war rapport card together at some point in time uh, for one of these uh, bigger games or a game that we feel pretty good about that's later in the evening where we have some time to do that. We'll do that together collectively at some point in time in the future. But until then, you need to be doing the diligence, which is liking this video letting us know the kind of content that you want to see when we're doing these fantasy picks that's all i got for you today it's your man ike jones the war report we are out of here until next time and as always war eagle and war report out